King Domino A simple, quick, and enjoyable little tile-placing game, King Domino is accessible to players of most ages. Live the fantasy of ruling your own kingdom of serfs today! Here are the stats. Let's get into it. You get four starting tiles in blue, green, pink, and yellow. Not coincidentally, those are the colors of the four adorable and completely useless three-dimensional castles. You also get eight wooden king meeples, two of each of the four colors. Finally, the meat and potatoes of the game, the 48 dominoes, displaying fields, forests, lakes, grasslands, swamps, and mines. They've got terrains on one side and numbers on the other. Try not to get them confused. Whomsoever creates the most fruitful and abundant kingdom shall be crowned the victor of King Domino. As always, set up first. Each player chooses a color, then takes the starting tile and one king meeple of that color. The rules technically say to use the castles too, but they're fully superfluous, so you needn't bother. Shuffle all of the dominoes using any of the methods seen previously in my Carcassonne video. Place the now shuffled dominoes back in the box with the terrain sites hidden. Draw the first four dominoes and line them up vertically in numerical order from top to bottom. Flip the tiles to show the terrain side. Have one player put all of the king meeples in their hand and randomly pull them out one by one to determine the first turn order. In that order, each player must place their king meeple on a domino, one meeple per domino. Finally, Create a new set of four dominoes in the same way next to the first four. Now, let's play! Taking turns in the order the king meeples were placed, top to bottom, complete these two steps. Kingdom building, where you take the domino you claimed and add it to your kingdom. Then, domino selection, where you claim a domino from the new set with your king meeple. Once all four players have taken their turn, draw four more dominoes and repeat, over and over, 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 and over. King Domino shall conclude once the last of the dominoes have been placed or discarded. The kingdoms shall be judged, and the ruler of the most plentiful one shall be known as the most formidable king in the land, as well as the winner. That's the basics. Here come the full rules. When building your kingdom, you must follow these specific restrictions. Your kingdom can only be five squares across at most in any direction. At least one square of the domino you're placing must match at least one square of one of the dominoes you're attaching it to. The starting tile is considered wild for this. Once placed, a domino can never be moved. If, for whatever reason, there's no legal place for you to attach your new domino, you must discard it back into the box and out of the game. However, if there is any place you could attach it, you must. Whomsoever has the highest score at game's end shall win. So let's get into how score is calculated. You'll need to do this for each territory in your kingdom, which is every section of matching terrain squares that are orthogonally, not diagonally, adjacent. Count up the squares in that territory and multiply it by the number of crowns in that territory. Add all of the products from each territory together to get your kingdom's total score. If any players are tied, the player with the largest single territory in their kingdom wins. If they're still tied, they both win. Huzzah! A peaceful union of victory has been achieved. For now. This game is best played with four players, but if you only have the lowly two or the odd three, this is how you can make it work. For two players, have each player take both of the king meeples of their chosen color. Discard half of the dominoes at startup, cold forever. Each round, each player will select two of the four dominoes for their kingdom. For three players, set up as normal. Each round, you'll just discard the fourth domino that no one has chosen. If you've already played King Domino a few times, the designers are nice enough to have included a few suggested house rules to shake things up. To play the Mighty Duel, set up for two players, but leave all 48 dominoes in play. Both players can build kingdoms that are seven squares across. To play Harmony, give five bonus points to any player that forms a complete grid with no gaps. To play Middle Kingdom, 
give 10 bonus points to any player if their castle is in the dead center of their kingdom, gaps or not. Finally, to play Dynasty, play three normal games of King Domino and keep the score running through each round. The player with the highest score at the very end will be the winner. Feel free to mix, match, or create your own play modes. It's your game, there are no board game police that can stop you from- Board game police, open up! I'm not going back to board game jail! So that's King Domino. That should cover everything, but if you still have any questions, put them in the comments below. If you like this, please take the time to click like, subscribe, and the notification bell. It would really mean a lot to me. Thanks for watching. Freeze. No!